Hi, Dave once again out in Western PA, USA. I work with uh, certain batteries and uh, some of the projects I upload to YouTube for uh, others that may be interested and want to get involved in home at school or at school. Okay, what do we have here? Um, magnesium rod over on the right with the larger clamp. Uh, you pick them up on eBay. Fire starters, you can use them perhaps, but these are uh, magnesium uh, cylinders. I have it paired with a graphite electrode. Your cathode, of course, is the magnesium. Your anode is the uh, graphite. What's our electrolyte? Uh, in this 150 milliliter beaker, I've got, uh, I'll be non scientific here. Uh, I got about three tablespoons of uh, potassium carbonate. You can use sodium carbonate, which is uh, consumers call soda wash. That's what I have set up here right now. Now, what is the red? Uh, those are simply uh, insulators, so we don't short circuit the electrodes. And uh, where did I get these? They're Velcro, and I popped them out of uh, hair curlers. If you go on eBay, you can find certain types of hair curlers that um, are plastic with a red, perhaps other colors, of course, uh, Velcro wrapped around. They peel that off. It's very convenient. Allows good flow of the electrolyte. Okay, what are we getting out of this cell? Uh, about an hour ago, it was 1.66 volts. We seem to be stabilizing at about 1.58 volts. Let's pull a, that's open circuit. Let's pull a short circuit. And uh, first I'll go to uh, the one o'clock position. And uh, that would be for a 1.5 volt, four milliamp load built into the multimeter. And uh, Boy, I'm getting uh, 80, 82 milliamps out of that. That's pretty good. Okay, let's go down there. 125.4 milliamps. It's pretty hefty. Okay, questions to be answered. How will the magnesium hold up? We'll build a, a very film, uh, very quickly uh, coating the electrode surface of uh, magnesium hydroxide. And... Uh, of course, in the aqueous carbonate, there'll be a small but significant amount of hydroxide. And uh, time will tell if this holds up. Can we recharge it? Well, it's magnesium. You're going to put a lot of energy in plating out uh, magnesium plus two cation. But um, this should have a, I would expect, uh, expect a good lifetime because of this sheer size of the electrode. So we'll see. I'll keep you posted. Bye for now.